At the start of the movie Julius Robert Oppenheimer he underwent a closed trial meant at destroying his popularity as the most influential physicist in that generation then from any other factor of view there was Louis Strauss who underwent a tribulation for eligibility could become America Minister of Commerce he instructed the story of how he first met Robert returned to Robert he explained the beginning of his fame as one of the maximum influential physicists. In his technology it all started out whilst Robert studied physics in Germany after locating out that he was really into physics and was a prodigy at that time Jeremy changed into developing and revolutionary theory of quantum mechanics after years of studying he felt that he had become an expert in quantum mechanics and physics so he applied for a job and became a lecturer at a campus in the Netherlands Hema met Israel Isaac Rabi who brought him together with a very famous German physicist named Heisenberg in 1927 Robert finally received a doctoral degree and a professor degree at one of the campuses in the US he then and taught quantum mechanics which were still uncommon in America he was also close friends with one of the world's top physicists named Ernest Warrens initially Robert only had one student but over time more students became interested in his class and liked to discuss with him because the lesson he brought was very interesting Lawrence then invited Robert to have dinner with the others at an event Robert's brother named Frank also came there Robert met with a woman named Jean who adhered to the ideology of communism since their meeting they became closer over time and became a lover it didn't stop there Robert also met a woman named Kitty and became so close to her that she ended up married to Robert James disappointed with the marriage but even so Robert still kept in touch with Jean the next day when Robert was at the campus Lawrence told Robert that he had to be careful because the Germans had succeeded in making a new kind of bomb which was believed to have a very powerful explosion and that he could be spied on by the Germans because previously he had studied in Germany and he could be considered a threat sure enough assume a general named Leslie Gross came and invited Robert to participate in a project called the Manhattan Project. The purpose of this project was to make a bomb that can compete with Germus which was more advanced to making new type of bombs since America was left behind in terms of weaponry they can lose badly to Germany. In World War II hearing this Robert agreed to run the Manhattan Project he then asked Leslie to make four research laboratories scatter no location called Los Alamos that could be reached by using trains and made a small town in the middle of it specially made for the workers so they could bring their families on duty that would take a very long time in addition the place was also suitable for this very secret research and also far from settlements for testing the bomb Leslie agreed and immediately granted Robert's requests inmate development Robert and Leslie met famous physicists in America to invite them to the project some of them disagree because of the requirements to stay in a remote place for a very long time but since the states needed their services to win the second world war again Against the Germans they had no other choice but to join in Isaac who was ordered to join the Manhattan Project was reluctant because this project could cause serious problems even a bigger one of which can destroy the world and led into a more terrible war but even so he had no other choice but to serve his country long story short the town was successfully built Robert along with the other physicists immediately started the project but soon after Robert found a problem because of an incorrect calculation a physicist named Edward Teller confused everyone Robert thought that Teller's calculation was wrong therefore a confused Robert went to see Albert Einstein for help after meeting with Einstein and giving Teller's calculation Einstein felt that if a bomb used this calculation the bomb's explosion will be so big it can even damage the Earth's atmosphere the next day Robert invited Kitty and his two children to live in Los Alamos because he had to be there often for the project after that Robert and other physicists discussed the materials to be used for the core of the atomic bomb namely uranium and plutonium which were expected to have the explosive power equivalent to a thousand tons of TNT but Teller suggested they use hydrogen because according to him the explosive power would be greater and they could get an explosive power equivalent to a million ton of TNT instead of the better options suggested by Teller Roberts still chose to use uranium and plutonium instead they then discussed the model of the trigger for the core fusion to detonate the explosion soon after it physicist. Men Colossus Fuchs came to participate in the Manhattan Project after Robert recruited him because of his actions for recruiting someone as he pleased Leslie was angry because it was a very confidential project and there could be spies from Russia or Germany who secretly worked there if they were not careful hearing that Robert agreed and asked Leslie to recruit his younger brother Frank and his best friend Lawrence the next day Lawrence and Frank came to help Robert in the Manhattan project in between the project Robert also secretly went to meet Jean several times without Kitty's knowledge they even tend to spend the night together 
together a few days later during a meeting Roberts colleagues boasted that they were not making a new weapon but a new history because the bomb will be a big breakthrough one day Robert got the news that Jean had killed herself in the bathroom of her apartment allegedly due to depression but there was another opinion if Jean was killed by the American government because she adheres to the ideology of communism just like the Germans Jean's death was a hard blow for Robert after Robert went over his sorrow he and the others got into trouble because their research was not showing any significant progress meanwhile Teller made the other physicist in no way for researching the hydrogen bomb which they decided not to make so the other physicists want to tell her to leave a project Robert finally intervened and started overhauling all the tasks of his colleague. Claus Fuchs was appointed by Robert to replace Teller's tasks not wanting to lose Teller Robert finally allowed him to do any research he wanted and would invite him for a meeting once a week after the tasks were overhauled the making of the atomic bomb finally progressed they started by making the model of the atomic bomb building the tower for the bomb test later and also testing the mini scale of the bombs feeling progress was made Leslie asked Robert to complete the bomb in July inevitably Robert had to agree even though he told Leslie earlier that the bomb would be finished in September Robert came to a meeting attended by several officials and a military general they discussed the location to drop the bomb on Japan because the Nazis had been defeated even though the bomb was originally made to destroy Germany they initially wanted to drop the bomb on Tokyo but it was opposed because there would be just a few casualties they all finally agreed to drop the atomic bomb on two cities namely Hiroshima and Nagasaki because these two cities were Japan's military headquarters moreover it was estimated that there would be a lot of casualties and for sure Japan would be forced to surrender long story short Robert succeeded in perfecting his atomic bomb and intended to test it by dropping it from the top of the tower that has been prepared all the physicists worked together to prepare the test by assembling a smaller scale of the bomb not only that Robert and the others also made several posts with calculated distances for them to see the explosion from the atomic bomb while avoiding the harm caused by the shockwave they intended to test the bomb at night so they could clean clearly see the explosion when the night came unfortunately the weather was not suitable for the test so the trial inevitably had to be postponed even though it was postponed they all still had to prepare for the test by checking the bomb periodically and after the ring stopped Robert started the test one of the physicists was also asked to see the changes in the electric current because the slightest change could be fatal the test went as expected and people were very happy because with the help of the atomic bomb Japan would be defeated and the second world war would end everyone in Los Alamos congratulated Robert for his brilliance in leading the research the next day after the test succeeded and managed to build two atomic bombs with a larger size and explosive power the two bombs would be dropped on Hiroshima and Nagasaki soon after succeeding in making the atomic bombs Robert somehow felt that his invention might also trigger another war between countries on August 6, 1945 the city of Hiroshima Japan was successfully bombed using an atomic bomb for the first time of course it made the military soldiers very happy with the landslide victory of America but not for physicists because thanks to their invention many innocent civilians were also affected America's big victory famed Robert Oppenheimer's name to the whole world Robert then went to an event to speak in front of many people who were very happy about his invention but even so Robert continued to feel guilty for the death of many people in Japan he even began hallucinating the next day Robert met with the president of America at that time Harry S Truman the president congratulated congratulated and won his invention which managed to save the lives of many American soldiers during a meeting Robert told the president that they had to develop cooperation in the field of atomic energy because Russia would certainly try to develop a bomb that was more powerful than what they had hearing the explanation the president ordered the advancement of Los Alamos for better explosive testing and manufacturing but Robert who was still reluctant because of the atomic bomb he invented and the feeling that he had killed many innocent people made the president angry the president President said that the world certainly didn't care who made the bomb but who dropped it and indirectly President Truman was definitely responsible for the deaths that night Robert attended a meeting where he met Lewis who told him that the person he recruited earlier namely Klopp Fuchs is a spy from Russia thanks to Robert's negligence he was suspected by the FBI for being a Russian spy Robert also attended another event where they announced the number of deaths from the bombings of Hiroshima and Nagasaki this made Robert's disappointment in himself even greater 
After that Robert met Teller who told him that the discovery of the atomic bomb did not end the Second World War instead it was the beginning of the First Cold War between America and Russia after his sacrifice for the nation he started facing many problems one of them was his problem with Lewis who felt humiliated by him during the trial for the export of atomic bomb material Lewis hated Robert even more because he considered that Robert had incited Albert Einstein to hate him when he brought Robert together with Einstein therefore Lewis contacted someone named William Borden to investigate Robert's past who had been close to several Germans and was also accused of being a Russian spy because of this Robert had to undergo a closed trial where Lewis ordered someone named Roger Robb to make Robert lose the trial from the trial it was revealed that not only about Robert's morale which was disturbed due to the effect of the atomic bomb he made but also mistakes from Robert's past such as appointing project members who turned out to be spies the death of his mistress and so on even though Kitty knew that Robert was cheating on her she still defended Robert finally Robert also dared to fight the higher ups at the trial after trial Lewis presented a testator that was sure would side with him named David but David instead revealed that many scientists actually hated Lewis this statement immediately made Lewis fail to become the Minister of Commerce after various accusations level against him Robert was finally declared loyal to his country but he had to lose access to the project which made him unable to participate in the development of the hydrogen bomb led by Teller but even so Robert accepted the results of his trial gracefully in the end it was revealed that Robert did not incite Einstein to hate Lewis but they both talk about moments in the past when Robert discussed the mathematical formula regarding the effects of the explosion caused by the atomic bomb that he was working on which turned out to have the potential to destroy the world thanks <laughs>